now none of these are overclocked, but all of them are doing full output. And I can probably even overclock a few of these and it won't really matter overall. <clears throat> I have also gotten a few hard drives because I needed a little bit of break from, you know, all the brain stretching to figure out these complicated setups. <laughs> like, it, it took me a while to figure out that I could not just put these willy-nilly. I needed to do six of them in a row instead of, like, alternating back and forth, forward, 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 forward. And the reason being is if I was to have one of these here, this pipe would not have the flow rate if I had one way down the line. And it's because the fluids would just go back and forth. So I had to set it up where all of these are pulling and draining from the same area so it didn't do the flow back and forth shit. It was an interesting little problem. And I also had to upgrade that to a Mach 2 Miner and it's overclocked so this is a full 480. Um, what else did I do in off time? Uh, steel production. Oh, concrete. Concrete, I basically took all of these that went into these uh, containers and I pulled and put a container up on my main belt over there and there's three um, industrial boxes over there uh, da, da, da. and they're completely full right now it, it, I didn't even realize they were completely full until a little bit ago let's get rid of you Um, wait, nah, whatever, still got a pathway. <clears throat> um, let's go out this way towards my seal production. Hold on. Hey, frog, how you doing? I'm doing all right. I woke up late, that's why I'm streaming late. <laughs> Um, I woke up about an hour ago. Now I was supposed to stream two hours ago. With thousands of lidless eyes watching your every move. Oh yeah, I never did fix this. Um, I don't have the copper. <clears throat> I will be streaming Mass Effect later. So, over here, if you remember, this did not look anything like what it does right now. That's because I redid my entire production for steel. All of it. Just all of it's brand new. I ripped it completely out, read it all. I'm now full capacity for a 48 belt or 80 belt or 10 of those and then whatever is left over is on the end and we'll be making black powder. I have not set up the black powder yet but that's what it will be doing. Um, all of my steel bars are coming this way to make into industrial steel beams. Um, the uh, three, yeah, three of these are making uh, pipes. <clears throat> Those are fully backed up. Um, want to say, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, my steel bars are completely backed up too. Yeah, that's cool, man. This early stream that I do is mostly me just building shit on Satisfactory. And right now, I'm mostly just going and explaining through what I've done because I don't normally off 
uh, off stream do stuff. We ran into some power issues. Had to get it done. Had to uh, fix the power issues. And while I was fixing power issues, I just kind of kept playing. <laughs> I need to fix this hyper tube though. Um, I got the pipe. I just need the, just need the copper. <clears throat> And there's my concrete. Got three industrials, they're completely full. Um, I also redesigned my advanced production area. I am still in process on it, but as you can see, I am extending this out like it's a big old bus line. And I'm gonna do like four rows of whatever my production is. And the inputs are going to come straight from the line here, input in, and the outputs are going to come out right here and go straight up to the top. So these are going to be the bolted iron plates, which is going to be interesting to set up because I might have to move these forward because I need screws, but I'm not doing that right now. Um, I did move my hub, which is why these are all flashing. Let's go ahead and fix that. Alright, there we go. <clears throat> I have gotten a lot of hard drives. I don't remember what all the recipes were, but I went ahead and set them down to cook. This is my overflow because I uh, had to... I destroyed everything, and I was in the middle of transferring, that's right. Here we go. Like a lot of this, I'm not even going to be able to transfer. Because I just don't have room for it. Um, you can go in there. Alright. Some of this I'm probably just going to throw into the heat sink. Not, not the sink. I think I can throw those in the sink. I'm not sure. About to find out. A lot of this just might go to the sink. I don't know. Um... Let's see if that can go in the sink. Yep, the appears to be so. Um, that can go in there. That'd be it. Oh, and I set up these modular engine production. Do I ever check out world music? What do you mean by world music? Just music from around the world? If that's the answer, yes. <laughs> music in other languages? Yeah, I do. Um, I think I got all the materials for this. I'm not sure. Okay, I did get enough materials for the um, smart plating. Do I have... I need some more rubber. <clears throat> got 40 motors there. Two... 300 motors, they consume two per, so about 150. Yeah, I'm gonna be short. Um, let's just dump them all, it doesn't really matter.
Liliana in Paraguay. I don't know how to say that, but we'll look it up. That was the first thing that came up. Pretty good song. Yeah, she does look super young. Full disclosure, not a huge fan of anything with lyrics. Not my thing. <laughs> Să vezi Lara, filmul pentru cinema alături de Iuliana și actorii din film. Te așteaptă un show special. 
Arată că știi să dăruiești. Lara și Crăciunul jucăriilor. 30 noiembrie, ora 16, sala Palatului. Bilete pe eventim.ro și iabilet.ro Can't say I'm a fan? like for decoration because I can see that it has like a stand that it's on. Lyrics don't really add to a song. The song is already made. Lyrics are just basically poetry on top of the song. They never lose their cool. Um bring it here let let's let's do this logistics conveyor bill let's put you there so if you're there I want how much do you consume consume 250 So 250 is almost a full one. And I can build four, so I need to build four of these. <clears throat> Just for spacing purposes, let's put one of you down here. Alright. And we want one tile, and then here. Similar. Industrial Almon like Marty Friedman's double kill. I think I've heard this one before. I think I have. And the answer would be yes if it's what I think it is. Let's find out. Yes, that's more what I'm looking for. <laughs> Alright, you can go like that. But I also want a splitter. Um, down like that. Yeah. Okay. So, finish 
constructors right next to each other will work. It's gonna be a little bit weird on the spacing for the last couple. That's why it sounded like I heard of him before. Um, where am I making plates? Oh, over here. 20. Okay, my alternate plate recipe is way better. So I need to get plastics brought all the way out here eventually. Um, that's the next project, is getting that up and running my train station. Alright, so... I need splitters. just going down one bit level. Over here though, this is where it's going to be interesting. Um, I want a stackable here just for aesthetics purposes. Bring this on over. What level is... What level, what level, what level? Um... That's... Silica, that's... Okay. Oop. Yes, I do like Enigma. Okay, we want... Splitter on this level. So, right about here. Let's see if that works. Nope, it's definitely off center. I 
the third one down. So, right. One, two, three. Right. Here. Yep, that works. Approaching clearance. Awesome. Um. Oh, dude, I like a lot of different music. It's the reason why I change music tape almost every stream.
No. I see what I'm doing. But how can I... I need to be higher. Um... Let's do this. Because then I should be able to line it up better. Still off a little bit. Oh my goodness. Why, oh why, is this not working? I don't get it. They're like lined up perfectly. And yet, it's still saying it's too steep, even though I've already done one. If I try redoing this one, is it gonna say it's too steep too? No. Why does this work then? Why? It's just ever so slightly off. Fuck. So I gotta do this perfectly. Yeah, that's making me want to redesign the whole thing. Really is. I might redesign the whole thing. Why, why you do this to me? Why you do this to me? Maybe it's perspective that I'm doing this at. We go inside the box. Inside the box. Yeah, I'm gonna have to redesign. Um, if I want to redesign, do do do. Get too much stuff on me. I'm going to redesign. Let's do this. Constructor. but one up. One up is encroaching. And I can't do anything with that. Okay. So I can't move those. So I'm gonna have to move this. But now that I know how to do this, it's a lot easier.
Okay. So I need to start you like here. Like that. And we'll come out. This first, just so that it has a line, and then we want to come up like so, up one. And then we can make the thing going up. I think it wants to go there.
fact, I'm probably going to expand this with a, another location and train it up. I don't know yet. We'll see. Which side will you choose? At 60 production. I need to upgrade that by a lot. Because, yeah. Oh well. Um. Outputs. Outputs. Normally, I would go like this. And then transport it up like that. And I get a merger to cooperate though. stack on top can't even see the other stack over here there it is Drop it. that I haven't upgraded this line yet bus though. I'm loving how this is built. Alright, so we want a merger going towards the top of this, which is going to be something like right here. And then let's get a... Okay, that's too close. see if that does what I want it to, which it should. There's 
my fleet. <laughs> uh, wait. know exactly why that didn't work at all but we'll try it again merger here and then Lift connection to it's off center. It is off center though. Y'all can see that it's off center, but it's still working. We're gonna leave it like that because I don't want to be messing with it. All right. So now we need to make this extend down like so. Hey, dude. Fly over this to the There we go. I got my plates going there. What's the next thing I need on the list? I think it's rotors. Yeah, rotors. Those are bars. Or I can do copper and screws. I need screws either way. I mean, is this make a minute? Four? I mean, is this make a minute? Eleven. Okay, we can do copper and screws. That'll be fine. If I need more copper, I can just bust it back from the other area. Um, yeah. Just as a reminder, this is going to be that. Over here, I'm going to want to make... Um... Probably the alternate still frames. That's probably what I'm going to be making there. Here, I'm probably going to be making satyrs. Yeah. I'm going to make satyrs there. Here, I'm going to be making... Motors. Because those are downstream. Yeah, we're gonna make motors there. Let's extend this out a little bit more. I got a feeling this is just gonna go all the way to my power plant. <laughs> Oops. Uh, there you are. Yeah, 
time did. <laughs> ah, didn't I? Okay, cool. Still a pretty big drop though. Alright, oh, I should have ended on that. Do I have any more concrete in any of these? Another question. Are all of these taken up with something? They are. Um, do I really need to stack these? I don't think I need to stack these. I think that's what's making this look spaghetti. If I space these out and they're all like next to each other instead. Have inventory management issues again. That's okay. We'll, we'll deal with it. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace everything with uh, industrials. Yeah. This is going to take a lot of space. Dude, I've already had two beers. <laughs> and I just woke up like an hour ago. Um Yeah, we're 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 definitely doing this. No, I didn't want to get rid of you. Appetizer for supper. Um, not so much. It's just more of a, hey, you're off of work, wake up type of drink. Okay. Let's break you down. This is like the third time I've redesigned this. But I really like my idea that I'm about to do. Because not only am I going to have expanded space, but everything should just live in there. A couple more. Oh, you should have seen it before the redesign. While it was interesting, it wasn't great. <laughs> it wasn't very aesthetically pleasing. And I was racking my brain on how I wanted to fix it for a while. And today I'm just doing redesign all day. In preparation of trains. Which, I haven't even showed off this train, but my train is sitting right there. I haven't built the track for it or anything. It's just sitting there. I got excited on my off stream play that I just went ahead and built it. Right now, I am working on redesigning my uh, bus area so that 
I have storage containers for every single item and I can just come across and pick up whatever I need at any time and I want to build Let me clear that list I'm gonna do that much later I want to build like 20 of these so I need steel beams and pipes okay all of you can go Still beams. I want to do it I don't think I'll be switching any tracks at all mm. Mm. how big are these they're like almost an entire square so I might have to redo my outputs that's all right Some of these just didn't look like they're in the proper location.
Yeah, that's the screw production that I had to stop. Okay. So, I can... What can I put on the third row then? Huh. When I have to put something on the third row, we could put um, modular frames on there. It, it really doesn't matter. Hold on a second. Gotta plug in my headset. Downloaded the demo. Demo is really good. Doesn't have a whole lot of uh, the higher tiers, but you can definitely get a feel for the game with it. Yeah, I think I'm going to put modular frames on that level. Um, so, we're looking at the third one, so that is going to be wire. Nope. I need... uh, da, da, da. Let's just, I don't have concrete on me. I don't have stuff. I need stuff. Where's wire? Wire. Actually, you're empty now. You're empty. You have wire. Let's grab all of that. Any more? Nope. Okay. So you're gonna be wire. And I forgot to do this. I need concrete. I need concrete. Where's the concrete? Here, here, here. I don't have any concrete. Really? Okay. We'll grab some concrete. Uh, let's grab three stacks. You don't have to be a gamer to enjoy a game, bro. <laughs> and I honestly don't understand what this term gamer is. It's always been a weird term for me. Because it means different things to different people. Let's bring it out one. Bring you out one. Just keep going down the line, one by one. left in the box. Nope. Grab a stack. Alright, so we are going to split off. Right here. Let's bring it on down. And across. This is looking so much better than what it did before. I just wish I could do a very short one there and bring it across. That would look a lot better. Gamer to you is someone very involved in PC games or video games, and they play every day for several hours a day. So by your definition, a TV addict or a TV connoisseur is someone that watches TV for several hours every day. That's the reason why it's like, what is a gamer? It's 
different types of entertainment. That's all it is. Okay, the next one's gonna be wire. Let's destroy you. Um, wire. Which one has wire? Any wire. You got a lot of wire. And you got wire. Any others? Back in the day, Stoner had a particularly, particularly meaning to. I mean, that one's more indicative of an actual something that someone does. Edu, edutainment. Okay. It's not much education over TV, though. Um, we are going to... It's right here. Split. Missing cable. Of course I'm missing cable. I just put them up. Um, right here. Going up to there. And then we are bringing it back down to here and across. And that looks so nice. That looks so nice. All right, the next one we're doing is what is that? Copper, copper sheets. Copper sheets here and here. Sometimes in the night, I'm so afraid. I got a whole bunch in here. Alrighty. Throw those in the storage. Splitters going here on this line. Straight on up. Here. Belt it down. Like so. And across. Nice. So I've never played Minecraft, and I have no plans on ever playing Minecraft. <laughs> it's just never been a game that appealed to me. Games like um, this, Factorio, Subnautica, um, Age of Conan, uh, no, Conan Exiles, I'm sorry, not Age of Conan. Conan Exiles, uh, Light and Dark, um, there's a lot of them. Uh, Rust, I've never played Rust, but I know Rust is the type of game like this. But it's games like that I enjoy playing. Never played Minecraft. I'm not sure exactly how Minecraft goes. But I enjoy games like this. One day I might play Minecraft. I'm never going to promise I will. Because the game just really doesn't interest me. But one day I might. It's a solid maybe. <laughs> Okay, I don't think there's any more silica there. 
Oh yeah, Subnautica is an amazing game. And if you like any kind of game with a little bit of story, a little bit of survival, um, a lot of building, a little bit of story, a lot of survival, it's a great game. Just an amazing, amazing game. Very few games like it. Like so, and make the conveyor coming down like that, and convey it over. It's a little off center. I don't like it. It's a little off center. Um, trying to eyeball this is kind of hard sometimes. Okay, YouTube, you're being annoying. Much better. Much, much, much better. Yes, I'm still watching it too. Uh, okay. Let's throw that in there, because I don't need silica on me. All kinds of ages play it. Subnautica? Uh, I could see that. I mean, it's not a horror game, particularly, but there's definitely jump scares. We'll do Crystal next. Crystal, 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 Crystal. Grab you. Subnautica is one of those games that I've played multiple times and will definitely go back and play multiple times. It's a that kind of a game. And I've honestly been itching to play it again, so after I get done with whatever this run's going to end up being, I don't know when I'm going to stop on this run, mind you, I'll be picking up Subnautica. And I might even pick up Subnautica again before I finish this, just so that we can play it. We'll definitely be coming back to this if I do that, though. Because I really want train stations at several different factories. Oop, never put you in there. That could have been bad. Um, I want train stations at several different factories. I want different factories to make um, tier 3 products and just busting it all of that gear. Um, next one's going to be pipes. You're empty. Uh, you're basically empty. I'll get rid of you. Got pipes in that one. Got some pipes in that one. Grab you. And we'll grab you. Bloop. Pipes. Do I have a map? This? I don't have anything labeled because I don't really use uh, beacons. Right about here. Why are you backwards? You're going the wrong way. Why? 
by. Did I put down a uh, I put down a merger, not a splitter. Um splitter? Splitter. Doo -doo -doo. Um, if I had to guess, I've explored maybe 20% of the map. I've only really been going between the oil over here and the coal and the uh, copper node that's over here. And the crystal that's up here. I think the crystal's right here. Um, and the, 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 the Caterium that's over here. And I did a little bit of sweeping over here just to get some biomass and look around for slugs. And I've pretty much done the edge of the map all the way over here. Still need to go to the edge over here, but not really into all that important to me right at the moment. What's the next level? I think the next is Steel Bars. We can get rid of that. We can get rid of that. Grab you. Honestly, trains or something that's better than these stupid trucks, because trucks are fucking terrible. Um, oh, I got a whole bunch of bars here. There that. But just anything would be better than nothing at some point. Because trucks are just so freaking terrible, man. I've outright complained about trucks ever since they were implemented, and I'll even show you why. Uh, let me create a truck real quick. Uh, uh, uh. The frames and other. And then the frames. So. Here's the problem that I have with trucks. And it's going to be the same problem that I have with train stations, mind you. But this is the problem I have with trucks. Right here, you have an input for fuel, you have an input, and you have an output. So, this can only be designated as load or unload. There's two outputs right here why can't this be double output or double input instead of you know load or unload there, there's literally no point of having load or unload here if you have an input and an output but you're only doing one input or one output that's my gripe about train uh, truck stations now with train stations, we'll just go over here because I have one built and it takes a lot of resources. But train stations have a very similar issue, but I think it's a little better of an option. Oh, and the reason why the truck station that's so much of an issue for me is you can only have one full belt worth of anything going into that truck station. So is it more worth it to have the truck station there or to just belt it all the way back? Because it's still the same amount of resources coming back. That's my issue with it. So with here, you have two inputs and two outputs and it's load or unload. So this is literally double 
the input or double the output. So you can have two full belts going into this freight platform. That's why I like this. And you can have multiple freight platforms, so you can have multiple freight cars. That is worth it, in my opinion. And that's the only reason why I actually want to get trains up and running. Because I think this would be fucking amazing. Because I can bust in mega shit tons of resources back to here. Funnel it all down this belt that I have set up down to my base and it's double the throughput so I'll have let's say I'm gonna belt back I don't know iron plates well I can belt back two full uh, belts worth of iron plates for this one freight car now if I have 10 freight cars just Think about that. If I have 10 freight cars all with iron plates coming in, jibesus. Because <laughs> that's going to be 20 full belts of iron plate going through to my base. The expandability of that is way better than trucks could ever achieve. However, I still wish this was turn on, load or unload. And these flip over to four outputs and four inputs. That's what I wish would happen. And it's something I put on the forums a long time ago. And they didn't even think it was an issue. So I was just like, you know what? Not doing trucks? We'll belt it back. And that's before they did trains. And I still hope one day they will have that flip option where the inputs and outputs switch instead of having it static. Because right now it being static, it just, it doesn't do what it really should, in my opinion. Granted, you can have a whole bunch of trucks do the same kind of thing. But if you have one, let's say you have one truck station but you have 10 trucks you're still only going to have one full output of any kind of resource but with train stations you have two so 10 trucks doing two full belts worth of traveling that's i mean you can still have like two or three trains doing the same thing going back and forth between train stations i don't know how i'm going to do that yet really don't know how trains are really gonna work in the long run but we'll get there we will get there you are going to be that I need a splitter it's gotten dark so I can't see as well okay so on this line I think that's where I need it. Right there. Let's double check. Yes. Okay. Alright, dude. Bring you straight down. Bring you across. And the next one is going to be industrial steel beams. Which I think I still got some over here.
you're going to be industrial steel beams. One of these days, I'm going to kill you. I'm not even kidding. And you're just going to sit there and take it this time? I'm bouncing off of you? Are you kidding me? I'm bouncing off of him. Debs, why did you make this into a trampoline and then make it hard as hell to get on top of them? I'm just pointing that out, but why did you make him into a trampoline, but it also make it hard as hell to get on top of him? I don't think I want to kill him anymore. He is now going to be my trampoline when I want to have a little bit of fun. Alrighty. You're going to be reinforced iron plates. I want to have this as a space because this is going to be a very long train anyway. Um, the next one's going to be a place for rotors. Yeah, rotors. Is that modular frames or rotors next? I want to, want to look. Oh. Exactly remember. Yeah, it was rotors. Um All of these later storage containers might be much farther down the line than this. And I might end up moving this one. I'm not sure yet. really depends on how things turn out later. Like all these might be like way over there. We'll find out later though. Uh, more rotors going there. Bloop. More of you. And more of you. Jeez, I got a lot of modular frames. Rotors, modular frames. Hey, frog. Welcome back. I'm still working on the same project before you left. <laughs> um, okay. And I've gotten all of that. Cool. Alright. Your rotors, your modular frames, you're gonna be satyrs. Okay, and you actually have an output that I can do. Oh, I didn't do steel beams. Steel beams. Um, 
said he might finish tits tonight. Mm, good luck with that. Need a splitter on this level here. It's not going to be perfectly aligned though. Because of where it's at. It's going to be close, but it's not going to be perfect. Yeah, I'm okay with that. That's the still beam, right? Yeah. Alrighty, and you gonna be split off from very top here. Okay, got my resource bus that I can pull shit from. Got plates being built. I think I want to try to lay down some train track, or at least foundation for train track. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Little bit of concrete there. And I'm about to finish this stream for today. It's almost 8 o'clock. And while I'm off stream, all I'm going to do is I'm going to extend, expand this out so that the train track goes all the way across. And I'm going to be building the train track all the way down to my, um, what you call it, reduction down there. Yep. I'm going to be watching Funky Stream. Which he should be starting soonish. Soonish. Yeah. Just going to expand this out. Make the train go all the way to. Uh, I'm going to make it go to Crystal and to. Fucking, um, what's it called? Oil. Oil production. I mean, I'm just gonna go raid him whenever he gets on. Till then, I'm just gonna keep on going. Yeah, and I want to move the train station over one tile so that there's one tile on either side of it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. Almost ready to send him the PS1 version of Bubble Bobble. That would be interesting to watch him play. Not gonna lie.
so nice to build in this game. So quick. I don't think I've ever played Bubble Bobble. I like know about it, but I've never played it, I don't think. Also has Rainbow Island. I know I've heard of Rainbow Island. I played like a little bit at a friend's house. Never beat it. this oh it's a gap there it's like why are you one level below oops Used to play it when it first came out in the arcade. I used to play um, a lot of Tekken in the arcade, and I mean a lot of Tekken and Mortal Kombat. Oh, and I also played a lot of that uh, driving game. I don't even remember what it was called. I just remember it was a driving game. Had its own seat and everything. Steering wheel. Pretty cool. <laughs> Gas pedal. Almost how I... I can't say that's how I learned how to drive, but it was definitely a good contributing factor. <laughs> Dude, I love driving games. At one point, my um, Mario Kart playthrough was one of the highest, yeah, one of the, it was on the list for world records. It wasn't the world record, but I was like in the top 100 or something at one point. I fucking love Mario Kart. And there's actually some tricks for Mario Kart that I didn't know about that would increase my time. Well, lower my time by a lot. So I just need to go and check that out and try to do it. That's what I played it on was the SNES. I don't even think I have my SNES anymore. Might be in a box somewhere. Not even sure. Ever since I moved back in the day, I don't know where half my shit is anymore. And I got a whole bunch of boxes that are just sitting in storage. I don't even know what's in it. And that's when I first moved back in. 
2006, I want to say. And I've moved several times since then, too. So it's not like it's just one move. I've moved four times since then, I think. Something like that. Three times. Sorry, Sega Master System, Genesis, NES, SNES, sorry, PS1, sitting on a table beside TV. That's a pretty good lineup. Kind of a shame that you can't play any of them anymore. Do I have... Yeah, I got some Caterium on me. I think there's a Caterium crash right here that I just never went back to fulfill. Let's go do that real quick. Yeah. Hard drive. Nice. Dude, if I kept some of my OG games, I would probably be rich right now, because I had a lot of games, and I had the original box and shit. I know one of them in box with the, um, the, the, the manual with it, sold for... 8,000 bucks. And when I saw that, I just kind of cried internally because I don't know what happened to that shit. <laughs> I think I gave it to my cousin. <laughs> that was the. Uh, it was Xenosaga 1. Mint condition. That shit sold for eight thousand. If you had a time machine, you go back and buy a bunch and keep them sealed. If I had a time machine, I would go back and buy more Bitcoin. That's what I would do with a time machine. I bought five Bitcoin just for, you know, token sake. And I bought them for like 10 bucks. And now that shit's worth 50, <laughs> 50,000. So it's like, hey, I wish I bought more. I just wish I knew Bitcoin was going to explode like that and I would have invested into it a lot harder. But you never know. Never know.
Why am I doing this? I should be, I should, mm, I'm, I'm, I'm upset. I'm upset with myself. I should be remote building, not building shit right next to each other. I don't like the song. This is not the playlist that I wanted to play, by the way. I had picked out a playlist and everything for Spotify, and then I forgot that I didn't set up my premium account on my computer yet. I don't even know what account that I have on my computer, but it isn't the one that I got on my phone. I just didn't want to go about fixing that now. Can send Funky Chessmaster 3000, but I doubt he played. it. If you send him a game, he would definitely play it. Not saying he would play it long, but he would play it. So much faster when I actually build shit correctly. shit where I don't want you. It's the only thing about remote build that is bad is you can fuck it up so easily. Does he know how to play chess? I don't know. He might. He might not. But I guarantee you if you send him a game he will play it eventually. Chess doesn't strike you as Twitch material. Dude, there are so many streamers that only stream either Battle Chess or Chess. You have no idea. <laughs> and they basically do AMAs and play chess all day. Frog, you, you need to you need to catch up on what Twitch does. Like, why would anybody want to stream me just building the same shit over and over for an hour? I'm just saying. But there are people that want to watch me build stuff in Satisfactory. Not the day, apparently, but I've had ten people in here watching me just build shit in Satisfactory. Although dubstep is a little bit harder than the normal type of music that I play. Alright. I am mostly down the track for the first section. There's a guy on YouTube just sits there for four hours at a time just smiling at the camera. I believe it. Honestly.
He got hundreds of vids just on that. Holy shit. Why? That just sounds so pointless. <laughs> All right, I want to build at least two more freight platforms, two more train stations, another freight train. That means I need two more, three more of those. I do not have anywhere near as materials that I need for this. Holy shit. Um. I think before I really get this off the ground, I'm going to want to get some computers and modular frames built. Yeah. So let's clear that list. I want one train state. <laughs> no, I want one train station, one freight platform, and we'll go from there. I think I got this in the storage. Yeah, I don't know. If he's doing that, it could simply be him just doing something that does something on the algorithm and people like it so they keep coming back to watch him do that shit. I don't even know. It's so weird that there's no way I could possibly give a good idea of what he's trying to do. Because it's highly possible that he's making money off of doing that. And we just would never know. Okay, I got five modular frames. Alright, let's put the hard drive to cook. Hard drive is cooking. Okay, okay. I need motors. Motors, motors, m m m motors. Uh, do I not? Okay, game. I forgot that I put you way over here. This is really... Here we go. Motors. Let's grab a stack view. Halfway done on these. I need rubber. Okay. I need heavy modular frames. What do I need to make those? Need five. Good thing is, I got plenty of all of that. Here's another box that I've been skipping over. I can grab you. I think the pipe's the only thing that I have built. And these. Let's go ahead and pull you out. One like so. There's nothing in this one. Yeah, okay. We want modular frames. Alright, I got enough to go build that. Yeah, I don't know what to make of that frog. That just seems very out of touch with life at that point.
Okay. Add the materials to make another train station. We're off to make another station. I think I want to want to get smart splitters too. Smart splitters will definitely help the whole train idea. Yep, got to give it a minute or two for Twitch to recognize that Funky's online and then we'll be swapping over. Floor too steep? What? 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 Oh, must be in line with another train platform. Okay. Um, we want to do over one more, I think. Like so. And the freight platform here. Like so. Yeah. About being a beta reader once in a while? You mean reviewing a book that hasn't been released yet? Is that what you're saying? Okay, this takes pipe and steel plates. Okay. I totally expected it to take something else. For short stories? Yeah, sure. I don't mind doing that. As long as it's not a novel, I can definitely guarantee you I would do that. <laughs> if it's a novel, I don't think I would sit through the whole thing and read the whole thing. All right, we need some of you. Let's do this right here, right now. We're making a container. We're storing everything of everything except for the concrete except for the beams except for that the motors that that and that and that and that okay I think that's everything alright what did I build those beacons for? I remember I was going to build beacons, those five beacons for something, but I don't remember what for. Um, not for the mask, it's not for the jetpack. I don't even think I want the jetpack, honestly. Maybe this? No. Although that is definitely something I would build it for. Why the ever lovely did I get beacons? I don't know. Hmm. Not sure. Not sure at all. 
Now for track, it is one to one. So stack of five to three stacks. Let's get three stacks and three stacks of this. Uh, let's get three more stacks and three more stacks of you and we'll fill the rest up with concrete. All right. Um, and we got one for you. I would like send us an email at the company and we can apply it to it add you to our betas list. Sure. Yeah, that's, that's cool. I think Funky's stream should be available to send over. It wasn't a moment ago. starting it's been another good one i will see y'all on funky stream yeah click that by accident that's all <laughs> i'll see y'all over there been a fun one see y'all with mass effect in what four hours or so. actually took the time to send me something i will always appreciate it even if they don't realize i already have something because if i ever get bigger at this there's going to be people who don't pay attention there's going to be people who don't know they're not going to know every little facet of every little thing they're not going to know all the games i have all the time so there's a chance you know i get a double of a game here and there over time from people who just don't know so far we've had a pretty good pretty good track record overall but just in general i wouldn't be mad at it that's all i'm saying I would still be much appreciated that people even thought to send me a game that they want me to play. Also, hi, Dragon. How are you? 